I think my mission in coffee is to keep chasing that perfect cup, which I don't think I've ever will, but we'll keep striving for better and better. But I came to Australia as a, a European professional handball player. While I had my sporting career, I always had a plan to have a hospitality as a, after I retire. Most of you guys probably don't know what handball is and that's probably one of the reasons why uh, I've had an early retirement when I was 23. So I started working in uh, functions, fine dining, uh, bars, but the moment I saw a coffee machine and got offered the job to work uh, in a local bakery just to make coffees, um, I actually realized, well, that's exactly what I want to do for the rest of my life. I want to make coffees. My relationship with the farmers, first of all, we're friends. Um, yes, we, we are demanding. Uh, on the other hand, uh, I work with the farmers uh, on a very friendly and, and gentle and developing way as well. And most of the time when we go to farms, I can see quite a few things that can be improved overnight. Um, but some of these farmers have been doing exactly the same process for 40 or 50 years. So we can't really make a change overnight. So I find it exciting and then challenging working with them in these little changes, progressing and um, having a better coffees from year to year. To work as close as uh, I work with a farmer, it's uh, I think for any coffee hunter that I can call myself, I think it's a dream come true. We can control any, any variable. We can go to a farm, spend few days getting familiar with the farm, with the soil, with the tree, age of the tree, and seeing what's the um, best process that we can maximize quality of that coffee. To these guys in, in Tallinn, I stayed, that was exciting because that's the first time they knew where the coffee was getting sold. What does, what does coffee mean to me? Well, my, my wife would call me up to three, four years ago that I'm, I'm passionate and but I think she reckons I'm, I'm obsessed with the coffee these days but it, it's a lifestyle it's for what I love doing some people go on holidays to see pyramids and and uh, Niagara Falls to me holidays when I go on a farm <coughs> taste amazing coffee and that's what gives me goosebumps so yeah it's a drug <laughs> I'm addicted <laughs>